What up, peeps? Welcome to the debate for the West Coast nominees for the NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Social Media Personality. I'm Tony Baker, and I'll be your moderator. And let's welcome Tabitha Brown and Kev on stage. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Okay, this is the first year the NAACP Image Awards has had this category. Isn't okay. that amazing? It's amazing, oh. Tap. Mind blown. Oh, so happy to be here. Hello, yes. hello, everyone. Hello, hello, America at home. Good to see you. Hope hey, that girl. stimmy hits. <laughs> <laughs> we brought you guys in because you guys are actually close, you know, because we couldn't fly in the other nominees because, you know, they live elsewhere. We're on a budget. Right. right. We did right. not have the budget for that. Yeah, we're no. on a budget out here. We're on yeah. a budget for that. Or food. Oh, yeah, yeah. we had a food either. Although I cook, I would have did something if they didn't ask. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. cool. Now, this question is for both of you, but I'm going to throw it to you first, Tab, for the answer. What does the NAACP Image Award mean to you? Well, you know, Tony, I would have to say it means freedom, right? Freedom to just be me, you know, to be seen, right? As you see in the caption of the NAACP, I am a beautiful person of color. Mm -hmm. And I just think to be able to win an award like that and share that with the world just keeps it going. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Bragging rights. Uh, <laughs> it means I am better than the people in third grade who said I would never be anything. Mm. Uh, it means that I will be referred to as NAACP Image Award winner, Kev on stage. Right now, mm. it's just nominated Kev on stage. It will mean the respect of my peers. It will mean uh, potentially another Maserati. I don't know. I mean, it just, it's, it's credibility, it's honor, it's respect, it's I made it. Okay. Thank you, Kev. <clears throat> Kevin, with Keep Your Distance this Friday, how will you use the NAACP Image Awards to promote this? Listen, well, what I would do is stage a debate where I could get Tabitha Brown and all her fans to watch a video because mm -hmm. she's in it and then use that to uplift colored comedians, okay? I've got seven other black comedians that I'm not, I'm not doing my own show, Tone. Mm -hmm. This is for the people. Right. You know, just for $12, you can watch black comedy persevere, okay? Because you know we have enough struggle, oh. but we need laughter and joy. Mm -hmm. So I'm using my platform to uplift the rest of the black com comedy community Okay. And then share that with the black audiences. Mm. You know, so whether I win or lose, you can come support. The main reason we're doing this, for me, <laughs> is to promote Keep Your Distance. So get your tickets, please, Friday, so that even if I lose, I win. And you win. So, Tab, how do you feel about Kev's blatant exploitation of this uh, image award to promote his comedy show? Well, I mean, I think he said what he said, right? I feel very used, um, not abused. I don't feel abused at all, but I'm glad that I can help bring joy. And people will, you know, watch the show. You hey. said $12, yes. Ain't about the 12? It's Ain't the one, too. It's just the one, too. Actually, it's 15. Yeah. I, you oh. know, we had raised it because of COVID. We had the yeah. COVID Oh, you had raised it? Yeah, because of COVID, COVID testing. Oh, got COVID oh gotcha. Crazy. But what about for my fans that are going to help your views? It's $15? twelve dollars for you. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Special oh, call for tab fans. Let's yeah, put that yeah, in. Yeah, yeah. There, there we'll it is. I mean, if we're gonna be used, honey, we gotta get something out of it. Uh huh. <laughs> Very good. Yes. Oh, that's all I have. Uh, since you know, I wasn't even put in in the pot on there. Now, speaking of pots, and that's sort of your specialty. How should grits be consumed? Salt and pepper or sugar? Well, uh, for me, my whole life. It's been with sugar, okay? Oh. I put a little bit of butter, but I also will add a little cheese, vegan oh, oh. cheese, okay? And that's also my business. If you have not tried it, don't knock. Cheese uh, with the sugar? Oh, cheese with the sugar and a little bit of butter. All vegan cheese and vegan butter. Okay. Mm. Yeah. yeah, well, Tony, look, uh, it's sugar for me as well. Um, and I know a lot of the community gets upset. Absolutely. You no know, sugar and salt and pepper. We're divided mm -hmm. on that. But I believe, as my good friend Tab will say, Come on. eat it how you like, because that's your business. business. Yes. But listen, blacks, I want us to know that that's okay. It is. We don't have to push each other aside. No, we don't. Because of a choice in grits. We got enough problems hey, hey. to fight over how we eat our grits. Come on. The more important thing is who are we voting for for this award? Hey. How do you like to eat them? Whatever you like it, I like that too if you vote for me. <laughs> Kev, if you win this award, what will be your first priority to accomplish in your new administration? 
Oh, the first thing that I will do <clears throat> is use my newfound fame to remind people about the Kevin Stage Studios app. Because it's another opportunity for me to help big up the black community. Such amazing creators like myself and Tab, who were largely excluded from Hollywood, but we had to make our own way and our own content. Okay. I'm seeking to do that for the average black creator. And we're doing that right now. So I'd use my new fame to tell people to go to Kev on Stage Studios in your Apple Store, Google mm. Play, Roku, uh, Amazon Fire Stick, anything. Download that app and help other black creators enjoy digital joy. Tabitha Brown, same question. If God blesses me to win, um, I want to feed everybody, mm. right? I want to have quarterly cookouts oh. and Sunday dinners. Uh, some people ain't able to eat, right? I will use this to, you know, get free donations for food. Not charge you for it. Not the five ninety nine. I would not do that. I would let everybody come for free. And if we just so happen to be able to come together, because we can also sell the place if we need the money, mm -hmm. we can all gather and watch Kev on Stage app. We can all buy it and watch it together. And also what I would yeah, love while to we do is feed homeless children, oh. mostly with li limbless, oh, okay. you know, and I would just be like, here's bread for y'all. Is that what you would do? Yeah, I would go to yeah. after school cares, scoop them up and hug them. Oh, you I know. didn't even know that that yeah, was part I, of your you plan. Yeah, because I wanted you to talk, and then I was going to add my second Got piece. It. The first thing was the app. But the, the key of what I really want to do uh -huh. is go into the jails, Ooh. open them up, let the black people out. Oh, is that? Oh. And feed them. And then let them And back. then, you know, oh. defund the police. Oh, oh. Reparations. Oh. Okay. Home loans. Free hospital health care. More stimulus checks. All right. Hairline transplant surgeries for those in need. Mm. Free know. plastic surgery. Butts for everybody. You know, oh. women, you want booties? Booties for all. Because <laughs> that's what, you know. I don't know. Jasmine um, Sullivan talked about that. Oh, Mr. On Stage, your time has expired. Okay, all right. Okay, I okay. feel like you're just grasping the straws, whatever sounds good at this point. Okay. Just to, you know, piggyback off what she was offering with the with the quarterly cookouts. Yeah. Which got my attention. Thank right. Because I'm excited about this. Yeah. Absolutely. In They'll LA? In worldwide. Oh. Everywhere. They'll be rooted in community and love and fruits and veggies for all. With wow. vegan selections. Vegan selections. Oh. Aren't you yes. I'm sorry, aren't you vegan, sir? Yes. You would get a VIP pass. Oh. I think there's like, I thought you were supposed to be like non-biased and partial. Oh, oh yeah, you know, I'm not Because I feel like y'all oh, no. was connected on the vegan tip. No, 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 oh, no, no, no. it was just a, a standard I was question. just getting yeah. clarification mm. on it. I, I feel like excluded as a, you know, because I'm vegan as well. Oh, that's very good. Yeah, yeah, I started hours ago. Kev, sometimes material gain can influence the way governance is done. Maserati Kev, for example. Yes, um... I got it. <laughs> you know, mm. I worked really hard for it. It was a big leap thing, Tone. Mm. I don't want people to think I was just flexing because it's not that. It was that in any instance, I was holding back what God had done for me. Mm. You know, and I read a, a book by Gay Hendricks and I was living in fear. Like, what if this? What if I don't make it? What if and, you know, I said, hey, you know, what if these things continue to get better? What if things continue to grow? Come on. You know, so the Maserati, they called me and they said, Kev, we got a black one for you. And who am I to say no? They you called know? you personally? because the, the Maserati dealership, yeah. Them. They called me. They said, we heard you was thinking about it. Come by. So I want to inspire people to get mm -hmm. the Maserati of their life. Mm -hmm. It might be a Lexus truck, like for Angel. Mm -hmm. It might be a Toyota Camry. You know, a Maserati is relative to your dream in life. So get the Maserati for you. Tabitha, would you care to respond? I mean, I don't really, you know, look at material gain as, you know, something that I need in order to influence, right? Love is free. Oh, wow. Isn't it? It's free. I it's think free. there's no price on a person's life. We are priceless. And because of that, I just want to continue to spread love. And so, you know, I just want people to know they are enough. You know what? You I just, that. while Tab was sir, talking, I just went sir, ahead and I, I donated Tab. Maserati to an HBCU so that black sir, kids could scholarship it. You have had your time. All right. I just want y'all to know let, I be spreading let love. Tab have this precious moment that's better than yours. Okay. But I'm, 
Mm-hmm. I'm not That's biased. Fine. It's fine. I'm being fair here. Continue. Well, I would just like to say, uh, Kev, you are enough. Oh, and see, this is what her videos I, do. I love you. See? And I know that sometimes you can get a little frustrated, you know, with life, but it's okay. I mean, you have hearts on your shirt. You are love. All right? You don't have to be anything other than you. She's doing that thing that make everybody love her. That's why it's hard it's to vote right. for her. And love is free. Yeah, that's it's why free. it's hard to vote against her. You see her. how I just said that? I didn't, it didn't cost me nothing. Yeah. It didn't cost you nothing to feel it. I feel people voting for her right now. Here we are. I'm voting for her. You don't have to have a Maserati you to don't. love and receive love. You don't. You don't have to have any monetary gain at all. So, Tabitha. Do you feel that a draw two card can be placed on top of a draw four in Uno? I do not. I think if it's a draw two, you can throw another draw two. If it's a draw four, you can throw another draw four. It has to line up correctly. It's just like if you stack eights or threes, the card's got to match. You can't just put a draw two over a draw four. Who does that? Who does that? Kev? Uh, I believe that the card plate is the only card plate. If I draw two, you pick up two, mm-hmm. and then it will be Tab's turn. If she draws four, I pick up four. Then it'll be your turn. I don't believe in draw two, draw two, draw oh, two. Oh, no stacking. No stacking. No stack. I oh, agree wow. with the I, no That's stacking. what I say. Let's just, now see, he's writing things down for me. I uh, had a deal with Uno, and they didn't tell me that. Um, <laughs> we played it. You know, Mattel, hello there. Uh, they allowed us to stack the twos and wow. the draw fours, and wow. we became family and friends. <laughs> Uh, so I say, however you like to play is your business. However, in order to get to Uno quickest, the stacking should be allowed. Kev, you're considered a, you know, a space connoisseur, if you will. What in your mind signifies talking across the board in space? And where is the line drawn? Well, this is a great question, Tony. I believe in spades you can talk during the bidding process. If Tab and I are partners, I can say, hey, Tab, I get you four, maybe five. Mm -hmm. Two and a possible, okay? That's a good hand. Right? But talking across the board to me, Mm -hmm. once the game has begun and you're trying to see who it is, you know what I'm saying? If I do this, oh, why you did that? Anything like that Mm -hmm. where you're trying to insinuate what you may have or may not have is talking across the board. Mm -hmm. Any direct conversation during the hand being played that leads to knowledge of your card to be played or further cards to be played, it's talking across the board. Mm. Excellent, excellent. Tab, you like to expound on that? I uh, absolutely agree. Thank you, you know, in, in the bidding process, I can get you two in the possible, you know, maybe five. You want to run a Boston, you know, those type of things can be said mm-hmm. in the bidding time. Um, I don't really allow the talking across the board unless it's me and my husband. Because mm. we can do what we want just our house. Um, you know, I've never played Kev. I don't know how he's a specialist because I've never played him. But we don't really talk, talk, but it'd be like, you know, play to win. Hmm. So and you do endorse talking across the table if it's your spouse? Not in a negative way. More like play to win. That's just our, that's it. Oh. Play to win. But that's really telling Chance no, that's just saying, to play high if he has it. it. I know, and I ain't never played with y'all, but I can see Very play to win means try and take this book. I got you. To win. Very interesting. You see that, Tony? Mark something negative. Always down. saying so play some to points. win. We just Felt saying play to cheating. win. Yeah. Not cheating, just play to win. I agree with you, Kev. Thank you, Tab. I also think we should play space. I would love to. I would love I to. I would do love that. that. Yeah. Now, is your wife your uh, partner? I'll be, uh, you know what? I play with Angel, probably. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, my <laughs> wife didn't learn. And for our marriage to stay intact, we don't, you know, we don't Got do it. that. But Angel's a great partner. She's great. So okay. we would love to play with you. Okay, very good. Well, if this doesn't work out, maybe we can do a spade competition. I would love that. Very Tab, good. I'd love yeah. to come over. Yeah. 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 Melissa, I love you. I love, I love you. you too, Melissa. And you <laughs> are enough. Put the camera back you here. You are enough. I love you more. Close out tabs. You are enough. I, you, no matter what your husband has said about you today. You are enough. And all the women in the world whose husbands denounce them as their spade partner, you are simply enough. And I love you. And anytime you could be my partner. Liz, Liz, Liz vote for me, okay? <laughs> if, if nobody in the, or else in the world vote for me, you got to. And don't, don't give none to Tab. She got all the people. Tabitha, is pumpkin pie an acceptable dessert to be brought to the cookout? Not really my cookout. I mean, if someone wants to bring it, um, God bless them. You know, uh, all pies matter. But 
uh, I would prefer sweet potato pie, maybe even pecan pie, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, that's just, you know, my point of view. I don't really know who, who, who brings pumpkin pie to the cookout. Well, you know, friends from work, colleagues mm-hmm. of a different Not persuasion, to the if you will, they might show up with the pumpkin pie. Not to the cookout. Not to the cook. Now, during the holiday season, mm-hmm. uh, we having Sunday dinners and things like that. You give people grace yeah. um, because they need it, you know, mm-hmm. if they're bringing the pumpkin pie. Uh, but, yeah, no, it's a no for me. It's okay. all right. Yeah. But I help them mm-hmm. and teach them about sweet potato pie. And how and we once can, you do that, then they'll never Yeah, they always bring the sweet potato. Yeah, or pecan pie. Yeah. yeah. Kev, on the record, for all the people watching and all these people here tonight, what is your stance on pumpkin pie? Well, as I listened to Anita Baker mm. during my cookouts, you know, I met her once. Uh, she retweets me all the time. Mm. Growing up, loving her music and being able to meet her in Washington, D.C. Now, the true story is my mom was a single mother, mm. okay, who was married at the time. And she gave us pumpkin pies because she didn't know how to bake. And she sat on the table, and when she passed away, although she's alive, um, I eat that pie to remember her, even though I speak to her all the time. So when people attack me for my mother's love, as a single mother who was married to my dad in the military, I don't understand where the anger comes from. You know, it's to honor her memory as she con- continues to live. Baby. <clears throat> so your mom is, in fact, alive. Yes. And well, and, and, and married, and, and, married. Non- and non-single. So I speak for all the black people in America who love pumpkin pie and are afraid to say it. You know, Anita Baker once told me, Kev, you are an amazing. Your time has expired. Okay, we're not going to keep bringing up Anita Baker. We just, we're just not going to do that here in this debate. Tabitha, what do you see as the role of your first man in this administration? Well, you know, my husband. Hello there, Chance. Uh, He's my best friend, Mm -hmm. right? And is my first man, okay? Uh, I think that we are partners in this. And however I lead, he holds my hand and we do it together very strongly. Um, And I just think that he will help guide me and be supportive and loving. And, uh, you know, as an amazing 23-year spade partner, I know I can trust him with my life. Uh, to not talk across the board or do anything like that. I just know that whatever is needed to be done, he will get done, you know, that type of thing. He also will put on all black in Tim's if he needs to and ride out. Um, He just has that potential. So I know I feel safe. And uh, yeah, that's it. That was not a threat, and I don't want you to feel as if it was, but I know my first man. Uh, he just handled business if he feel like somebody messing with his wife. I mean, what is better than that? Right? Yeah, I can't yeah. think of anything. And his love and support. Mm-hmm. Careful Kev. what you say, Kev. Careful what you say. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, my wife, you know, the first lady in my life, longtime Spades partner, I also trust her. I'm with sorry, my um, wife. moderator. Yeah, I feel um, like she's jumping over to my side of the thing. Did he We've say that his wife spades wasn't his space so partner before? Years. He did I just say wanted, that I, I wanted to be I, fat. I he did love say that her right. ability to cut um, the same way Tab's cutting in on my time here. Oh. Um, I was just asking for the facts. I just thought She earlier. is a beautiful woman. Mm. I love her very much. She's very supportive and loving. All I'd ask for her is to be everything because she's already everything to me. Mm-hmm. Um, and to you as you're watching, babe, I love you. I, I just, you know... When we were 16 years old, uh, and I fell in love with you, um, listening to Anita Baker's Rapture album, oh Under God. the Bleachers, of our high school just, football game. I just... What? Kev, for the sake of America and all the colored people in attendance today, and me, Anita Baker should not be mentioned again. Okay. Oh. I just met her the one time, and she it's retweets great. me it's all the okay. time. That's, That's great. Time. I just, Kevin, I, I just would like to remind you again that you are enough. I see you stop, sp- Tab. I'm I already be saying, crying I, at your I, TikToks. I, I How do you feel you. like you're talking to me, and I be by myself? I'm just you saying, say hello I, I, there, and I be I say hi back. But yeah. I know you're in the phone. I know. I just I just see you spiraling right now, and I <laughs> want you to know you're all right. This is a safe environment. 
Or what I said about my husband early was not a threat to you, and I feel like you're a little nervous. Now. I am a little nervous. I'm, um, I'm sweating. It's okay. Under here. <laughs> so I'm all, you I'm, all right. I'm flabbergasted. Yeah. The suit don't button. It's I'm a little heavier than I was at the beginning of quarantine. It's okay. That's your business. <clears throat> it's all right. So now we've reached our final remarks section, and uh, so we have a brief final remark from you both. We'll start with you, Tad. Very good. Well, uh, I would first and foremost like to just thank the NAACP. I am literally, my hair probably isn't, you know, Donna, she maybe not normally this big, but my mind is blown. So she's sitting up a little bigger than normal. <laughs> um, I'm very grateful to even be thought of, but to be nominated, my goodness. Uh, and for everyone who has watched today, all of you who have attended, we appreciate you. Kev, to be standing here with you, my brother, it's just, my heart is full. To all the other nominees, God bless you all. I'm just grateful to be in the midst of you all, right? I feel like a winner just to be nominated. And you know what? I wouldn't even mind if maybe we could just run together. Couldn't we run the world? We could all together, couldn't all of us run the world yes. together? Yes. Yes. I mean, that's how I feel about it. But I'm grateful. I'm thankful. And uh, God bless you all. God bless America. Mm. Yes, in the NAACP. You are a winner, Tam. What? Thank you. I, you Thank are you so really kindly. just, you know. You just, I appreciate that. Where's yeah. the. Uh, do I get to answer? Yeah. She. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, I'm not being yeah. biased, but man, I appreciate. Come you. on, man. I'm this gonna be cooking later. Oh, I know you like vegan wow. things, so. Oh wow! Uh, this is you are you are welcome to come as oh, well. Okay. Yeah, I'll cook it for everybody. Everybody. Matter of fact, why wait till we win to start the cookouts and Sunday dinners? Let's start it now. You know, after this, if you're watching, come on over. And we would love to have you. God has blessed us with space. Uh, as my good friend you told me, would say, her. we have a crib with open spaces. And I would love to have you all come over and eat. So that'd be great. This is wonderful. You too, Kev. <laughs> and bring your lovely, lovely <laughs> wife, your spade partner sometimes. Sometimes she is, sometimes she isn't. You bring her, and we all together will be family at mm -hmm. the table. I know who I'm voting for. <laughs> Kev, you want to go ahead and give your final remarks? Yeah, I mean, listen, Tab, it truly is an honor. I am just so godly proud of you. I, I, you know, I remember the first video I saw of Tab. She said, just do it, man. Renegade, renegade, renegade. And, I, and I've been a fan ever since. Um, lovable person. And to all the nominees, Desi, Budgetista, not Carlton Banks, all of us are worthy to be nominated. You know, uh, I'm just glad to be in the number. You know, whether I win or not, we've already won. The nomination is the victory. Um, is I'm preparing to lose, uh, to tab or anybody else, but I'm already won because I was nominated. You know, Grammy Award, Grammy nominated people say Grammy nominated all the time. That's yeah. right. Some of them never even win a Grammy. That's that don't right. stop them. Mm -hmm. So I'm always going to be nominated. They can't take it away. And if I lose, everyone will pay. Everyone who doesn't vote for me will pay. No more videos. I will go on strike. I won't make another video for a year if I don't win. That's all. Not Rich. a threat. I will just be so <laughs> upset that I didn't win that I will punish you all. Mm. Wow. Oh. Let me know how much it is to run this facility because I'll take up the payments if you want to go ahead and let it go. Because people need to know, you know, good content still is there. Um, but if you can't handle it, <sighs> I, Tony, I'm sure you and I, maybe we can oh, go in together. Can, I would love to work with you. Yeah, we could well, do that. That's yeah. amazing. Tab on stage. What? Wow. Wow. Yes. I ain't even gave my name yes. up yet. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh I, I thought you had already denounced it. Oh, my bad. Fantastic. We, Wouldn't we that could be really nice? create a lot of content. I together. think we could. So that concludes our debate for the NAACP Image Award nominees, West Coast, for the Outstanding Social Media Personality Award. Um, don't forget to vote for your favorite. Uh, you can vote every single day leading up to the awards. So click the link in their respective bios and vote for them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Tab. Thank God bless you. Thank, thank you, you all, you, America. Kev. God bless you. Vote for me, please. Thank you all. Vote for whoever you want to because that's your business. Oh, this okay. Is just, yeah. You see what I'm saying? This yeah. is. Kev, I'm going to vote for you. Oh! Yeah. She's impossible to root against. Yeah. She's literally love personified. <laughs> Kev, you all right? You need a hug? I'm sweating, Tab. You all right? Shoot. No, I'm not showing up if I don't think I got a good shot. Anyway, thank you so thank much. Thank you. She smells good, too. Oh!